Well, the Breeze Walking Festival is back for another year, offering Cantabrians a wide range of fun walks and activities just in time for the school holidays, as Chelsea Daniels explains. For the third year running, the Breeze Walking Festival offers Cantabrians 37 free walking trails all over the region. It's very exciting, we're going, it's the start of the Breeze Walking Festival and it's happening over the school holidays and it starts this weekend, tomorrow. And isn't it great that the weather's got a lot better? So we're really looking forward to it being a wonderful sunny day. The walking tours span beyond the city centre as well. We're also branching out into the Selwyn district and also Waimakariri. She says it's not only about walking and getting exercise, but taking a good look at our region's development since the earthquakes. We've also got Greening the Rubble walking tour. So that's bringing people into the city to um, have a really look, good look at all the projects that have been going on in the city since the earthquakes. And it's not all about walking. There are also lots of fun activities that you can do as part of the walking festival. So for example, we've got one called the Linwood Youth Walk, Youth, um, Walk and Climb. And yes, you do have to do some walking, but you're also going to do the, you're going to end up at the rocks and do clip and climb for an hour. The festival is in its third year and she says it's bigger and better than ever. It started in 2012 so, and it was a direct response to the earthquakes and we thought, hey, so much broken but let's do what, what we can and what we've got left and make the most of what we have got. And also the fact that, hey, walking, oldest form of exercise, still the best form of exercise and a wonderful opportunity for people to just catch up with each other. So connecting people with, with people and also with places left in Christchurch. And it's not just walkers with two feet either. Last year we introduced the Great Dog Walk and that was so popular. So if you can imagine 400 or to 500 dogs and their beloved owners taking them for a trot around the groins, then that's the kind of size of some of the events and it's absolutely fantastic. The festival will run for the duration of the school holidays with the last walk scheduled for October 10th. Chelsea Daniels, CTV News.